Her entire shed came off in one piece, except for her nose. Right on the tip of Cleo's nose, you can see a patch of stuck shed skin, and I kind of thought this was going to become a problem. When Cleo was in the midst of getting ready to shed, when her eyes were fully in blue and her skin was very gray, she was rubbing on her enclosure trying to get out. And during that time, snake's skin is very sensitive. That's one of the reasons they tell you that you shouldn't help a snake shed its skin because if you put too much pressure on it or if you start to peel it off prematurely, it can damage the scales that are forming underneath the skin and it can lead to issues like this, which in Cleo's case turned into her nose not shedding properly. But that's all right because the rest of her shed came out perfect and now I'm giving her a bath to try to help her with this last bit of stuck shed. Speaking of which, there's the rest of her shed. It kind of all clumped up like a sock. But now let's see if I can get that piece of shed off of her. And nope, it is still stuck. And I'm out of time for this video. But don't worry, I'm going to post a part two tomorrow. So make sure to like and subscribe.